What's up YouTube? Today I'm going to be rebuilding the Chicago Bears with Caleb Williams. This is a roster that has all the up-to-date moves on the Bears and everything else and all the other teams. Like It's up-to-date on everything, but to get Caleb Williams, I got to sim to the postseason to get to the draft. Alright, let's sim to free agency. Okay, we are at the off season. This might be the weirdest Super Bowl. I did not expect the Chargers to be there, especially since they don't have Keenan Allen or Mike Williams. Let's hope Keenan Allen didn't re didn't retire or be so it wouldn't be as realistic as I would like. Okay, Keenan Allen did not retire. Okay. I'm gonna get the flea agency and see if there's any players. I also need to re-sign some people. Okay. I do not see anybody I want to re-sign. Okay, let's check flea agency. I have 70 million to spend. Well, the Stillers must have not signed Russell Wilson to another year. I guess they only wanted him for that one year. Wow, these receivers are really expensive. I'd rather draft one at that point. Okay, this is the only two players I got. Everybody was kind of too old in flea agency. And I really didn't want anybody too old because this is going to be a long rebuild. Okay. Got the first pick. I'm going to take Caleb Williams. Okay, there's not many, I mean, there's tons of good people left, but, to be honest with you, like, if I wanted another receiver, I kind of wanted Xavier Wardy, but I don't know if he's going to fall to the second round. I do have early second round picks, I think that's what I'm going to do. This team needs a lot of help. I don't even know if we need corner. But as an Alabama fan, I really want to take Terry and Arnold, and I think I'm going to do it. Okay, let's hope Xavier Wardy is here, because I really wanted to take him. Yes, he is. I know he's got to be fast after that combine. Okay. Xavier Wardy is going to be the next Tyreek Hill on my team. I need a defensive tackle. I'll take this guy and hope he's good. No more dev. I kind of used all my early picks on players that are really like they're gonna be good, but I don't know if they're really gonna help my team. I'm just gonna sim the rest of the draft and see who the CPU picks. Okay, this is how my draft looked. Caleb Williams, number one, Terry and Saunders, number nine, Xavier Wardy. Everybody else was kind of clap. And I can't believe I used my door round pick on this guy. I think I'm going to make a trade. I have co commit, so I really don't need Everett. Okay, Jermaine Johnson is my new right end. Okay, this is my team year one. I'm gonna sim to mid season. Let me just look at the defense. Defensive tackles, I definitely need some of them. I need to move Terry and Saunders up. I want him to get let's see, I'll put Terry and Saunders at number three. Terry and Saunders at slot corner, Xavier Wardy at slot receiver. Okay, I'm gonna sim to the mid season point. Okay, at the mid-season point, we are three and three, so we are really mid. Check these stats. Okay, the offense is awful. I think I need to change the playbook. Okay, Caleb Williams isn't necessarily even doing bad. He's doing really good, actually. I just need to change the playbook because this is not it. I think I'm gonna go to the Chiefs playbook since Doors focus is around tight end and we got co commit. Let's see how this offensive line is doing. Okay, they're not doing bad, they're doing pretty good. Defense. 
one pick. That's not good kicking. Yeah, I'm gonna advance to the playoffs and see if I make it. Okay, we missed the playoffs. Okay, Caleb Williams actually did really good. I mean, I don't know why the team missed the playoffs, but. The offense don't even look bad to me. Let's see, why is Xavier Woody's stats so low? I put him at slot corner. Got a lot of upgrades though. I mean, slot receiver, not slot corner. Tay and Sona didn't do bad. Let's see, he's got some upgrades. Gosh, Jalen Johnson had five picks. Oh, offense was number 19. Our oh, defense was number 28. I guess our offense got better near the end and then our defense went down. I'm a sort deal. He just won a lot of money. I'll give him a two year deal. He only allowed two tackles. See, so yeah, I'll give him a five year deal. We are whole but. I don't really need him because I have DeAndre Swift. I might let him walk and see if I can re-sign him in free agency. Let's check the yearly awards. Kayla Williams won Offensive Rookie of the Year. Xavier Ward, he was number 10. Defensive Rookie of the Year. We don't have anybody up there. Oh wait, we have Terry and so on. Oh, there's a lot of good players in Flea Agency. Oh man, this guy's expensive. Man, Nick Chubb would be so nice, but he is so expensive. This is the people I offered. Some of these people shouldn't get any offers so they should end up taking I under offer them all okay so far I got Elijah Moore and Johnny Smith on really cheap deals oh man I'm not gonna get Elijah Missile this is what my flea agency ended up looking like I know it's not the most deciding thing but I'm gonna draft a defensive tackle and maybe something else. I just gotta see when I get there. I think I'm gonna trade away Keenan Allen since I just got Elijah Moore on a cheap deal. Let's see Keenan Allen. I don't know how Jacksonville is willing to give up Malik Naples. Probably gonna try to trade for a defensive tackle though. Ooh, if I could get Ed Oliver. Okay, honestly, I was not expecting that to go true. But I now have a defensive tackle. Now I need a center and a right guard. That may end up who I that may be who I end up drafting. Travis Hunter is here, but I do not need corner as much as I want to take that. Let's see. I need offensive line. There's not many top offensive line guys. Center. Right guard. I'll take this guy. I wish I scouted him more though. Okay, this guy's here. I think I'll take him. Hopefully he's good. Okay, he's a hidden dev. 
I'll take this guy. It looks like he has pretty good stats. He's hit a dev. Dre for Dre on hidden devs. How has this guy fallen so far? They gotta be a bust. But I'm like kinda curious even though I don't need corner. Okay, this may be a bust. But if it's not, I'm probably getting a force round talent in the door clown. Okay, I think he's a bust. I'm just simming the rest of the draft. Okay, this is what my draft looked like. Not the best, but not the worst. Will Rogers went undrafted. I think I'm gonna sign him as a backup quarterback. I know I still got Tyson Badger. Okay, this is what my team looks like going into year number two. I'm gonna sim to the mid-season point. Okay, at the mid-season point, my team is four and three. This is a very tight division though, so I don't know if I'm gonna make the playoffs. Okay, somehow my team won 10 to 2 last week. Very interesting. Let's check the midseason stats. Our offense is number 20. And our defense is number 22. Caleb Williams is doing good. DeAndre Swift is doing okay. Receiving is okay. Walk in. It's okay, I guess. No substance. We made the playoffs against Detroit. Nine and eight, nine and eight. Let's see. I'm actually curious who won the regular season between these two teams. Okay, we won the first game and we lost the second game. So, I don't know if we're going to win this, but I could see us win it. Let's see. I'm going to hop into Sim and see what happens. And it looks like we won. Yep. Okay. I don't have much confidence we're going to win next week's game, though. Oh, I forgot to check the yearly stats. Let's check those real fast. We had a number 25 ranked offense. And number 23 ranked defense. So very mid-team. Caleb Williams did not do that good. I actually think he did better. Last year, yeah, he did. He did better on this rookie season than he did here. On touchdown and on substance ratio, at least. Running game, we did all right. I wish I could have gotten Nick Chubb in free agency. The receiving glue did, the receiving gloop did pretty good. Xavier Ward, he did a lot better this year than he did last year. Let's check defense. Okay, a lot of interceptions. Almost everybody had one intercepts and even Terry and Sean are on kicking did good too. Okay. Oh we got an injury. Oh we got a lot of injuries. Most of them all one week. Except for our left guard. Okay, it's another nine and eighteen. Almost every team must have gone nine and eight. 
Oh yeah, all three of the teams on the NFC side are nine and eight, except for the 49ers. Really hope we can win this. Would be nice to win playoff game and keep advancing. It would be. I have a feeling this video is going to be a pretty long time, so be nice to win it now. Okay, this is looking good. I think we may actually get this. Come on, come on, kill the clock. Yes! Okay. On to the NFC Championship. I wonder if we're going to be facing the 49ers or the Giants. And of course the 49ers. I'm not feeling very confident about this. Okay, surprisingly we got the lead forced. Okay, well, oh no. Okay, they got a touchdown. Oh, they just, I guess they got an interception or something. Okay, now we got a touchdown. 14 to 14, come on, come on. Three points. Come on, come on. Okay, this is looking good, this is looking really good. Okay. Oh no. Oh yes, we got an interception. Oh, just kill clock, just kill clock. Yes! We're going to the Super Bowl. Okay, we are playing the 14, I mean, we are playing the 14 and 3 Baltimore Ravens. Okay, let's jump in the sim for the Super Bowl. So, like, we could actually do this since we took out the 49ers who were 14 and 3. Okay, I really hope we can pull this run away. I will be taking control in the fourth quarter just because I want to show you guys what this team looks like in game. And I kind of want to see what it looks like in game too. Okay, it's the fourth quarter. Okay, I'm taking control. Which I know the point of the rebuild is supposed to be for the CPU to have control, but like at this point, I don't think it matters too much. I mean, I'm in the Super Bowl. I just want to show you guys what this team looks like. And like, you know, Caleb Williams has done good in this game, but he really hasn't done too well in the past two seasons. I mean, his rookie year he did pretty good, but this year he kind of had a down year compared to last. But, you know, watch the Bears in real life pick somebody like J.J. McCarthy or something like that just to catch everybody off guard. I mean, the Bears have not really been good at picking players and getting the team figured out. And honestly, like, the Bears got a lot of hate for moving on from fields, but at the same time, it kind of makes sense because, you know, it's a lot easier to build a team when you have a QB on a rookie scale deal. It's kind of hard to pass up the opportunity to get Caleb Williams. Which, you know, I, I do think there's a chance Caleb Williams could end up being a bust, but, like, I highly doubt it. Okay, let's see. Try to hit a Xavier Gordy here. DJ Moore. Oh, my gosh. The O-line was not there. Kind of want to run that same play because the Xavier Gordy so fast. He has potential to get off fast on this play. DJ Moore. Okay, got it. Okay, I'm gonna try to get a touchdown here. I do think Caleb, shoot, I did the same play. It's okay, I'm just gonna do it. I do think Caleb Williams, he looks like he fits the Bears jersey pretty well. Like, I can get used to seeing this. Okay, touchdown. Okay, now I just need to stop Baltimore, or at least hold him to a field goal so it'd be easier to come back. Okay. They got Derek Henry, they got Zay Flowers, they got Lamar Jackson. This is going to be a hard team to stop. Okay, come on. Mark Andrews, too. I forgot about him. But I do have a really good defense. Now, second and 
on defense. Come on, he's definitely past you. Come on, yes, defense. Okay, fourth and one. They got to punt it to me. I don't see him going for this. Yep. Okay. I think my defense may be better than my offense on this team, honestly. Okay, Xavier Wardy. This might be my favorite play on the team, just because of speed. I can't get nothing there, though. Shoot, I just did the same play again. I was on the recent tag. Well, partner, here it is. They've got the chance to win the game. You'd have to Save think they need to get it near the opposite 40 to have a chance to kick a game-winning field goal. Like I wonder who the Bears are going to draft with a ninth pick, though. Like, I'm curious if Bowles falls to them, if they'll take him, even though they don't really need tight end. But, like, Marvin Harrison Jr., if he falls to them, or so Malik Nables will fall to him. No. I hope they don't take Xavier Wardy because I kind of hope Xavier Wardy goes to the Dolphins. But I don't think he'll fall to 21. But that would be so nice. Oh no. Okay. 13 seconds. I have a feeling that's going to work. Oh, my O line did not block that. Just going to let the clock kill. Actually, the two seconds I'm going to go for. It. Send Xavier Wardy deep. And uh, send Elijah Moore on his zig. And DJ Moore out deep. Okay, my running back is not going. Uh, receive it. I said the puppy kicked it, so I could have got an idea of what I need. The good thing about receiving, though, if I get a touchdown and they get a touchdown, I'll get it forced after that. And then if I get a point after that, then I win. So it's the bear. Keep in mind, things are different than the old way it was. The Buffalo, Kansas City Classic. Oh, shoot. They get that off fast. It was fun. The plan has got to be. You win the okay. toss and you take the Swift. ball. Swift. But it's first and ten. The kidder here. Again, he'll drop to throw. Yeah, DeAndre Swift is a good addition. Hopefully he walks out for the Bears next year because he is really fun to use. Like, honestly, shoot. Like, I'm a Dolphins fan, but, like, I could, I could use the Bears a lot with this type of players. Like, Keenan Allen and DJ Moore will have. And maybe Malik Naples if they draft him. Be so cool if they draft a Dallas Tornal or Tavian Saunders or somebody like that. I will say though, though, if you get a better O line for Caleb Williams, like he can be really good. Oh shoot! Bob is gonna fumble. Just tough. Shoot! Get the ball away. Oh my gosh. I double tapped the button and accidentally did a punt fake and it almost messed me up. I just love the Bears uniforms, honestly. Wardy, come on. I'm so glad you're after this Avery Wardy, honestly. In the second round, too. Like, I, think, I think it was the second round. Get him off. Come on, yes, touchdown. Yes. Terry and Arnold. Let's go. Terry and Arnold again. I do not regret drafting him. He's been killing it this game. Come on, come on, come on. Get him. Yes. Okay. If I can stop him, the game's over when we win the Super Bowl. Get back, get back, get back, get back. Stop him. Yes. Game's over. I tried to run it back, though. Let's go. Oh, we just won the Super Bowl. It took a season 
No, two seasons. It took two seasons. I wonder who gets Super Bowl MVP. Probably Caleb Williams. I don't think he had any interceptions. I think he had like three touchdowns. Let's see. Whoever they hold up in a second will be the Super Bowl MVP. And it is Caleb Williams. He won Super Bowl MVP. I would consider this rebuild complete. If you guys did enjoy this video, please be sure to like and subscribe. And if you enjoy videos like this, check out my last video where I rebuilt the Pittsburgh Stolos with Justin Fields. And thank you guys for watching. And y'all have a good night.